Welcome back, it's Eva from Lush Cues Nails and Plus. I'm here to do a quick tutorial showing you probably something um, relating to coffee. So this plate right here is from GoGo Only. It's the Saint Lover plate. I've had this for a while. I actually never used it before, so I'm thinking I'll uh, stamp a couple of images and the theme will be coffee. So um We'll probably end up using this one right here and then maybe just a couple here and there but um, for my base I have a Revlon polish this is called wild strawberry and then I sponged um, my nails just like this with that same color this one right here and the white from funky fingers now if I could only find my sponge, I don't even know what I did with it. Oh, here it is. So, this is, uh, I'll show you guys what I did. I'll uh, do my thumb real quick. Just brush on a little bit. And then take some of that and just kind of do it like that. And sponge it over the nail. Or dab it whichever way you want. If you don't like the way it looks like that, it's too white. So I might just take a little bit of the pink and dab it on just like that. You can let that dry or clean the sides real quick, whichever way you feel comfortable. So after that, we're going to stamp using the color brown. This is from Revlon also. It's called Hot for Chocolate. I've had this for a long time. It stamps pretty good. Not too bad for a brown color. And what I'll do is I'll try to just stamp this right here on one of the fingers and then maybe the word coffee. I'll put it on my pinky. So let's see if we could do this. Let me find my scraper here. Here's my stamper. So let's see if we can do this. Let's see if I can line that up before it dries up. can't really see it too well, right? Hmm. That's okay. Alright, now we're going to try to stamp the word coffee on my pinky. Here it is. I gotta put this down. I think I got all of it. Yep. Can you guys see that? And then let's move on to another image to the right over here. Let's do, let's do this one. There's that. I like the way that came out, so maybe I'll do that again. And then on the thumb, I'm not quite sure if it's dry yet. Let's see if we could, I probably can't get the whole thing here because my nails are not long enough, but let's see what we can do here. Nope, it's not going to be long enough. So here you go. 
let me clean up real quick and then I'll show you guys the finished look. Alright guys, I'm back. I wanted to show you the finished look. This is how it came out with the top coat on. Here's the thumb. I stamped the first image I started off with. Let me know what you guys think. Of course, if the nails were longer, it looked cuter and I can't complain. But um, thank you guys so much for watching and take care. Bye!